This is a quick tutorial to share how to manage your notifications in Schoology. There are two ways to do this. Let's start by managing our notifications course by course or group by group. I am in my courses, so I'm going to go ahead and open up my course, fourth grade. And in this course, I'm in control of the notifications or alerts that I would like to re receive. So I'm going to go ahead and click notifications. And here you'll see I can check off notifications that I would like to receive or uncheck notifications that I would no longer like to receive in my mailbox. So I'm going to uncheck these notifications here. And after I make changes, it's important that I go ahead and save changes. Okay, so this should work as well inside of your groups. If you're in a specific group and you want to make sure that you're receiving notifications or turning off notifications, you can do the same here under notifications. I'm going to go back out to my courses real quick, my list. Um, and I want you to know that in general for all of the courses and groups that you are in, um, in your Schoology account, you can go ahead and hit the drop down and you can manage settings in general. And so when you hit your drop down where your profile name is, you can go into settings. And from here you have some settings that you're in control of. I want you to take a peek at notifications. So here in notifications, I get a lot of information. For example, turn off all notifications. Um, you'll also see that I have different devices that I've logged into Schoology. So I can um, take off those devices as well. But these are possibly receiving push notifications, right? So I'm going to go ahead and uh, take off my phone and uh, disable those notifications because at this time, I don't want to receive those notifications on my cell phone. So again, you're in control of that. If you look here, they're broken up into segments. So this is academic, okay? We have school groups, public groups, and personal, okay? So you have uh, some, several options and choices that you wanna make sure that you go through and read and make your decisions. So in academic here, I can see that a course update is posted. Right now in EPISD at home, you may be receiving emails every time there is a course update. I kind of like those right now because I'm seeing when there are specific professional development opportunities. But again, um, in general, you can turn on all email notifications for this or turn them off. But maybe you just want to receive some from specific sections and not all. And so you do have the option of customizing and checking off specific courses that you do want to receive notifications from. If I only want to receive them from EPISD at home um, and maybe the elementary curriculum, then I would check off those. And if I do not uh, want notifications for those anymore, I can uncheck it. So this is also a way for you to see which courses you're a part of and which ones are sending you those notifications. So I'm going to go ahead and uncheck this because I have another way of finding out what my messages are. So I'll go ahead and click Submit. So take the time to decide. Here, if you want to receive email notifications, if you want to customize those notifications, if you'd like to receive them on mobile devices that you're logged into Schoology for. So those are really important. And then again, make sure that you save your changes. Okay. So alternately, since I've turned off a lot of my notifications, I do know that I can always check notifications here and uh, my messages here without having to log in um, and checking all of my emails. Okay. So if I click here on messages, I should see that all of the messages, there was a message today, but all of the messages are here. Today at 6.49 a.m., there was a, an update posted to EPISD at home. So I received my messages here, okay? If I wanna see my notifications, I can also click notifications for this bell and check off my notifications here as well. So even though I'm not receiving those emails, I still have access to notifications and emails here within the course. Okay, so that was a quick tutorial about how you can go ahead and manage or turn off notifications in Schoology. You can go course by course, group by group, or straight on over to your settings to make a change for your entire Schoology account.